feelings, of course, I'm in here. Fletcher, live from my room. Now, I know I've not been in my room a lot lately for my videos, people. I've been up the road or somewhere else for my videos lately, and I apologize for that. I mean, everything. First off, I just like to say that this video here is going to be how I want the drive to go, and you know, you know not exactly what I can find, but how I want it to go and everything. He has over my drink before the video. Who cares? Anyway, I think that this is going to happen like this, you know what I mean? Huh. Well, that's not what I think, but I want to happen. I want to see the only take to go to Raw. I know it most likely won't happen. I just like to see the only take to go to Raw and see what he can do in there for a while. I mean, he's been on SmackDown for as long as I can remember. I mean, he makes a few appearances on Raw, yeah, but I want to see him a Raw superstar. So that that week ain't interesting to me. Another thing I like to see, I like to see Jericho get drafted to Raw. I mean, hell, he was on there almost all the damn time anyway, even when he wasn't a Raw superstar. And after he lost the Unified Tag titles, he was still uh, on Raw. So you know what? I like to see him back on Raw. He made Raw interesting. Him alone with the Miz is the only reason I had to watch Raw. So that means also let me keep Miz on Raw. You know what I'm saying? What do you mean? The Miz gets right, he's still going to be on Raw right now. Because he's going to be tag to that piece. On half of it. But I want to see him stay on Raw. Let's see what else. Uh, no, this one I'm pretty much pretty sure is going to happen. But I also. I really do hope they do, from what I heard, I hope they really do send Orton to SmackDown, because that would be a very, very good thing. You know, I like to see him on there, and actually see him feud with Jack Swagger for the world title, and, you know, that would be awesome, because, I mean, hell, as XBA said, you know, like 2004, again, you know, or whatever the hell that shit motherfucker used to do, that shit was, I won't get my, I won't break my Orton shirt out for my next video, I'm gonna break that out for y'all. Old school as hell Orton shirt. Yeah, it's worse. Old school as hell. Hold on, hold on. Let me see if I can find it real quick. Let's uh. Let's see if we can touch. Other draft picks, you know. Did I win that? Let's see. see who they can send maybe. You probably just seen like Evan Gordon. Let's see the same one. T-shirt. Who gets it? Mm -hmm. But, uh, the gentleman send over to, uh, to the show. Uh, I actually think that, you know what, the women titles, the deep women deep title, they should switch shows, go back down they were, is what I'm saying. The, uh, send John Morrison over to Raw. To feud with Miz if he loses the Unified Tag Title that way. Uh, uh, over there. And everything, you know, feud with Miz over that title and Raw. Uh, see what else we can do. We can, uh. So we only got two shows, and I mean, so I'm pretty sure he's taking you part of the draft. More hard to do this. You know, I used to like when it was ECW because you know you had like lower stars there. And, you know you could just see them in one of the other shows. Uh, you know, I would always do some Christian to Raw. <laughs> then you know the uh, you know what? I can't do that. What, do you think Jericho to Raw? See, Eddie to Raw too, so they can continue their feud over on Raw. That's what I'm saying. Continue this shit over on Raw. I say, see, I say, see, you know what? So you can have a cross promotion, a cross brand feud. Because you know, Troy and Sheamus are still feuding. Send Sheamus over to SmackDown. 
numbers of your opponent will be pretty much half my damn draft picks here, but who cares? It's my draft picks. What I doing? Send them over there. You know, uh, let's see what else we can do here. Poof. Damn. I should have thought about this a little more before I did this video. Who cares? I'm just thinking of these ideas right off the top of my head. Uh, trying to do this for y'all. You see that? Don't you know me? You know what? You know what? No, we got another one. I got another one. I know it won't happen. I got another one. Yeah. None of them. What? Actually, Batista, I think he's still part of the Smackdown roster. So he's been on Raw even in that way. Send him over to the damn Raw. He's still part of Smackdown. Send him to Raw. He got a little Smackdown banner down there. He needs to be on Raw if he can be feuding with John Cena. Point for him. True story. Feuding with Mars, not making any sense to me. Well, let's see here. No, not looking at me. I think it's over right now. If I think of more people, I'll let y'all know about the video. Let me think about it. I'm trying to do this right now. I'm trying to think of this. If I think of more people, though. Okay. And then at the draft, I will immediately fall in Raw. Not a bow, not really me, but right after Raw. Sometimes after Raw, within the next, within an hour after Raw, in a few weeks, and at the draft. I will make another video talking about the draft and everything and what picks I like, what picks I didn't, all this stuff, you know. So look for that. And also, remember, I'm awesome. Plan, but yeah. Anyway, also look forward to my video for my first 18 subscribers. Remember, I had my little goal. So my old channel I had 18 subscribers and I left it. I want to get past it. I got 19 now. So the first 18 people, y'all are getting shout outs. And that's the bottom line. Because be lazy 478 says so. Peace. Yes, I just stole from Stone Cold. Sue me, man. Or Stone Cold. Or England. Sue me.